What's going on everybody? We are out here at Holly LS Fest. It is Thursday. We just got the Buick, the Mazda unloaded. I'm going to be running the Buick and possibly a few passes in the Mazda. April's mostly going to be making passes in the Mazda. Um, I'll be making the first ever quarter mile, eighth mile hits in the Buick. So hopefully get all that dialed in, get the car working, the bump box, kind of everything just tuned in. So if we want to go quarter mile race it, we can. So we are going to get the cars uh, up to the tech, get them teched in. And then that's pretty much going to be it for the day. Uh, might do a few little things, just checking on everybody, seeing who's out here, checking some of the cars out. Um, and then tomorrow we'll start racing. Welcome to LS Fest. So we are on our way to rescue the Buick. <laughs> We drove it around last night and then I guess we just didn't put enough pump gas in it to cruise it. So we're pretty much on the entrance road here, but it's really crazy. There's a ton of people here. Um, so just trying to get around and get through what we need to get through. Check out all the people still waiting to get in and get parked. Pretty crazy. We came in yesterday and got our spot. So saved us a little bit of hassle this morning. Need some fuel? It's always something, I swear. Hey! All right, we got fuel in it. <laughs> Back on the road. Good thing it uh, ran out of fuel like on the entrance road to the track. Easy enough. We're gonna get back, do a few checks on the cars, and get ready to go all right everyone so we finally got everything set up ready to go the buick is going to go make a pass here in a minute i'm going to drive it for the very first time put kind of a uh a soft tune up i guess you could say 14 on the gate so we'll see what it makes um up top just going to run it if it feels good maybe let it ride to the quarter uh at least hopefully an eighth mile because then i can always calculate and figure it out from there but they're calling us kind of right now is the time to go make a hit so i'm gonna go go up there get some of the grass off the front of the buick we're out mowing, mowing the lawn out here. So it's pretty nice. There's grass. It's beautiful out. Can't can't complain. Lots of cars. It's pretty busy, but so I'm gonna head up there now and hopefully make a good first lick for a uh, quarter mile in this thing. All right, the car is in the lanes. We uh, missed the first call by like I guess 10 minutes or whatever. So we had to wait. Now they called us again. So now we can make a hit. Um, I don't know. Should make high teens in boost and. Hopefully go mid, low nines? I don't know, just kind of guess. We'll see what it does. pull in the Buick for me first ever real pull for it in the quarter uh, and it goes 933 at 156 mile an hour so it was mile an hour pretty good right there um, I actually missed the turnoff at the end of the track just a little bit so I had to flip around but we're gonna uh, look at data try to turn it up and see what we can do here in a little bit so I came in here looking at the data and it left on three pounds of boost and ramped out to looks like 17 pounds of boost 17.6 on the very top to go 156 mile an hour so Pretty decent. Looks like I made 18 right there. 17. It's pretty much 17, 17 and a half pounds boost. So definitely need to try to leave on some more, uh, get the car set, and then add some more up top, and hopefully get this thing in the eights pretty easy. Well, I ended up having three on the dome to leave on, and ramped it into 14. I'm going to leave with five, go up to 17. I also added 300 RPM to the two step to see if we leave on I don't know seven, eight pounds of boost and get a decent 60 foot out of the car. All right, everyone, we are getting ready to make some hits. Uh, a couple oil downs, been busy. So the Buick's ready to go. And we actually got the Mazda right there as well. So I'm gonna make a hit, April's gonna make a hit. We'll try to get some video for you guys, but kind of gotten uh, tied down on not 
getting a bunch of time to make some hits. So we gotta gotta do it when we can do it. So we're gonna make some hits right now. Mom's ready to go. Hopefully she can click off an 11 second pass in it and finish up the day here and go on to tomorrow. pass didn't go very well, good it shook the tire and then spun how'd april do they go 11 no it went 12.03 at one point dang it so, so close, so close. 12.03 at 114 mile an hour i think i can get it though you'll be able to get it it's definitely has it in it 12.03 that's awesome we'll get an 11 before the end of the weekend so job i didn't fare so well on that one but it's part of it i put way more in and it didn't hold it so <laughs> yeah the track's not very good but it's all right, at least we uh, have a little more data. Hey everyone, day two from LS Fest. We're gonna get the Buick up the lanes and Holly's actually shooting a little feature on the Mazda. So hopefully soon to see that coming as well. They already did one on the Buick. Um, so I'll make sure to share that with you guys when we get those. But I'm gonna take the Buick up there right now, change up the tune up a little bit. And we're gonna go see if hopefully it can hook. Um, turn down the bottom just a little bit and left the top where it was at. So hopefully it'll, it'll mile an hour well and maybe get a high eight here. So, and then April's gonna be right behind me to try to get her 11 in the Mazda. ran right there but april should be like two cars behind me maybe three or four so i might try to stay right here hang out because that felt super good like just made a good clean pass grab the shoot everything felt really good mile an hour well 60 foot felt a lot better than last night so we'll uh, look at data see if we can turn up some more and hopefully that was an eight it might have been a low low nine but uh hopefully it, it felt good so hopefully we got an eight out of it There she is. Hopefully that was an 11. <laughs> Here she comes. Hopefully she uh, stalled it up and got enough. Look at it rolling around there. See what she thought. You good? Well, it went to second and it just flapped. It what? It just stopped. Like it just, I don't even know. It 
would just like push the car back and then it went. Huh. Well, we'll take a look at it. See how it did. <laughs> All right, heck yeah. 887 at 162 mile an hour with only a 149 60 foot. So that was that was a good pass. 582 to the eighth. 127 mile an hour. So we'll definitely put some more in it. As long as the track will take it, we should easily be able to click off an 850 pass here. All right, so that was the fastest pass I've ever had on the car. 887 and 162, I guess, quickest as far as time, quarter mile stuff. Um, we're in the lanes again. So it is pretty hot out. It, the track is really greasy, but we're gonna go try to make a hit, turn it up a little bit, see if we can go near that 850 range. April's got the Mazda ready to go give it another try. It's hot, so it might even slow down, but uh, gotta keep trying at it. Maybe we'll get the, the car will do what we need it to do and get a good good launch out of it and get it stalled up right. And it, it's kind of weird since it has a stock converter in it that it's hard to get the car to do what we want it to do as far as like trying to stall it and leave. We don't, you kind of launch it and then you don't, and it, it changes it up. So, um, but otherwise, on the Buick, that last pass was 20 pounds of boost and it went 880s. So, we're going to try um, going. Probably 22, 23 pounds of boost, probably 23-ish pounds of boost, and we will see what it does here. All right, everyone, so after about four long breaks and multiple cars breaking and oiling down the track, hopefully nothing else breaks so we can actually get up there and make a pass. We've moved about half this distance back here in like four hours. in that pass felt really good i'm just hoping that we got a slip because reaction time seemed to off. so i just hope that it didn't trip the tree or something went goofy but it should have got a slip felt good riding up top making good power so we will see what it did right there
of day two of LS Fest and 848 at over 100 and I think 67 mile an hour. Uh, fastest I've been in the quarter, almost my fastest pass I've ever been in a car. I've been 530s at like 130 in the eighth. But uh, man, 167 mile an hour, it's, it's ripping. So um, we're still running cars out through here, but we're on our way to dinner. And then we're gonna come out tomorrow, probably a half a day, maybe make another pass, load up, try to get hopefully halfway back home after uh, the trip. Losing my voice, it's getting rough. Um, staying out in the parking lot of the hotel, just chatting with everybody's been awesome, but talking to all the people about the cars and everything here at the event, just everybody checking them out. If you guys have came by and said hi, we appreciate it so much. Glad you guys enjoy the cars and everything, but we will be back for day three of LS Fest tomorrow. Everyone, so day three is a quick one here. We just showed up, hung out for a little while, watched a few passes, but we got a long, long drive back to Colorado. So we're gonna go ahead and load the cars up and get out of here. But I appreciate everyone for watching. I hope you like the LS Fest content. I'm sure we will be probably going to West and then back here next year. That just, what an incredible event. The cars, the people, uh, the parking lot stories, everything in between, meeting cool uh, people and just, just everything, just a cool atmosphere. So we appreciate everyone for watching. If you would, please hit that subscribe button, and we'll see you next time.